Parties on a grand scale, but when 15,000 people turn up on a chilly December night, you know something extra special is in the air. Tonight, that something was the Olympic torch arriving on Parliament Hill after a day of celebration across the city. The CBC's Hannah Thibodeau reports. This was the moment the crowd of 15,000 was waiting for. It was the Flames' latest stop in its 45,000-kilometer journey, igniting Olympic spirit on Parliament Hill. This flame has traveled from Greece uh, across the world, across Canada. It's been up north to Nunavut, and to get it here in Ottawa, in the nation's capital, just no words to describe it. Dion Metcalf was one of 187 torchbearers who carried the flame a total of 54 kilometers in one day. The Olympic flame made its way past many landmarks in the capital, from Parliament Hill to the National Art Gallery, then past the Prime Minister's residence. Retired General Romeo Dallaire carried it to Rideau Hall. Ending back on Parliament Hill, exactly two months before the Games get underway. They will announce to the world Canada's arrival as a sporting powerhouse. People waited for hours to get a glimpse of the flame. How can you not be here when such a historical moment will happen in our own backyard? I wanted to, to be part of the, uh, the celebration of the Canadians going for the Olympics and wishing them all the best. The torch now makes its way through southern Ontario and then it heads west, ending up in Vancouver on February 12th for the beginning of the 2010 Winter Games. Heather. Hannah, thank you very much. Hannah Thibodeau in Ottawa tonight.